Again, this is uh, Bonifacio A. Alos Jr., your pink clown, the math teacher online. I'm going to give you an example of a fraction, solving fraction, uh, making use of the remainder theorem, and at the same time po, same problem po, isusolve din po natin yung ating um, synthetic division. Okay, example for this one, remainder theorem po muna tayo, ha? So, we have function of x, eto, kahit na ano na lang po yan, ano natin, okay? So, we have 3x cubed minus 8x squared plus 3x plus 2. Okay, so yan, kahit na ano na lang yan po yun dyan. And then, the divisor po natin is divided by, um, hmm? we have, kunwari, we have 3x minus 1. Okay, so simplify na natin, equate na natin kaagad, itong 3x minus 1 natin, so we have, 3x minus 1 is equal to 0. Transpose natin. So, we have 3x is equal to positive 1. And divide both sides by 3. So, we have x is equal to 1 third. Ito po ang gagamitin natin. 1 third. Okay? So, we have f of x or f of 1 third. Lahat ng x, papalitan natin ng 1 third. Is equal to the 3 1 third cube minus 8 1 third squared plus 3 1 third plus 2 Okay, lahat po ng x, pinalitan ko lang po ng 1 third and then simplify ko po PEMDAS, exponent po muna tayo parenthesis Okay, so we have is equal to 3 1 cube is 1 3 cube is 27 minus 8. 1 squared is 1. 3 squared is 9. And then, dito wala muna tayong gagawin. Okay? So, 3, 1 third plus 2. And then, what's next? We have whole number multiplied by the numerator. So, we have 3 over 27 minus 8 over 9 plus 3 over 3 and then plus 2 ngayon most of you ang gagawin nyo na lang po is LCD hindi po if may nakita po kayo na possible na lowest term po natin gawin nyo po agad agad yun kasi mas maganda pong mag solve habang mas maliit po ang number 3 over 27 can be reduced to 1 over 9 Minus 8 over 9, wala po tayong magagawa sa kanya. 3 over 3, that is plus 1. 2, wala din po tayong magagawa sa kanya. So, kopyahin lang po natin siya dito. And then, what's next? Diyan na po tayo ngayon mag -e lcd Okay. So, we have is equals to all over 9. And then, kopyahin lang natin tong 1. Minus 8, dito po tayo makakaroon ng operation. So, we have 1. 1 divided by 1 times 9. Uh, 9 divided by 1 times 1. So, we have plus 9. And then, 1, a uh, 9, divided by 1 times 2. So, we have plus 18. Uh, dito, continue natin dito. ha? Okay. So, we have... 1 minus 8 plus 9 minus 18. So, we have the answer is 28 minus 8 over 9. Anong ginawa ko dito? Lahat po ng positive number, 1, 9, and 18, inat ko po siya. And then, minus 8. So, yun. So, we have equal to 20 over 9. 
Some of the math teacher, yan na po yung gusto nilang maging sagot. Pero some of the other teacher, gusto nila po na improper or mixed number. So we have 20 divided by 9, that is 2, 2 over 9. This is the final answer po natin. Okay. Now, making use of the synthetic division naman po. Same problem. Dito naman po tayo sa kabilang board. Okay. So, function of x is equals to the 3 x, ano na yan? 3x cubed. O, tinitignan ko na lang sa kabilang board. Ah. Minus 8x squared plus 3x plus 2. Divisor natin is 3x minus 1. Yung nangyari kanina, um, 3x minus 1 is equal to 0. 3x is equal to positive 1. Then, divide both sides by 3. So, x is equals to 1 third. Ngayon, yan na po ang gamitin natin para sa ating um, synthetic division. That is, 1 third. Numerical coefficients, we have 3, negative 8, positive 3, and 2. Okay, start na po tayong mag-compute. Bring down 3. Addition ang gagamitin natin, ha? Okay. 3 times 1 third, the answer is 1. Negative 8 plus 1, the answer is 7. 7 times 1 third. Oh, nahihirapan yung may students ngayon dyan. Ang gagawin lang po natin, whole number times the numerator. So, we have 7 over 3. Now, What's next? Okay, negative pala yun. Sorry. Uh, uh, negative 8 plus 1 is negative 7. So, this is negative 7 over 3. Okay, oh, nakakamali din, no? Pero buti na lang. Na-check natin beforehand. Okay, next. 3 plus negative 7 over 3. So, what's the answer? Ha? Huh? Ano po yung sagot natin? We have... Two-third. Bakit po siya naging two-third? Kasi the divisor is three, mag-LCD ka po dyan. Okay, magiging itsura po dito ngayon nito is nine over three. And then, nine minus seven, ang sagot po natin is two. Okay, again, refresh your knowledge on the fraction. Para hindi po kayo nagugulat. Saan nakuha yung 2 thirds? Saan nakuha yung negative 7 over 3? Okay? Next, 2 thirds times 1 third. Numerator by numerator, denominator by denominator. The answer is 2 over 9. Addition po tayo. So, we have 20 over 9. Paano na naman po ulit nakuha yung 20 over 9? So we have, ang itsura naman po nito ngayon is 18 over, ilan? 18 over 9. Pinarehas lang po natin dito sa denominator niya. Okay? Kasi ang 18 divided by 9 is 2. Okay? So 18 plus 2 naging 20 po siya. Eto, yan. Then, divided by 9. Or, ang tulad nung ginawa natin kanina, ginawa po nating mixed fraction. So, we have 2, 2 over 9. The same answer doon sa nakuha natin doon sa remainder theorem. Okay? Ito po yung kanina. Ah, ngayon, yung sa synthetic division, ito naman po yung kanina na remainder theorem. Okay. Which of which ang gagamitin po natin magiging the same pareho at Pareho-pareho po ang sagot natin. Okay? Here po in mathematics, um, in any other uh, method na gagamitin mo, you will be deriving at the same answer. As long as wala kang nilalabag po na rule, law in mathematics. Okay? So, thank you po mga, ano, mga... Math Ibai, good luck for examination, God bless, and thank you very much.